Hello everybody, welcome to my let's play of Death Road to Canada. Uh, I'm gonna start so the music stops playing. It makes it very loud. Um, so, th I've been waiting for this game, for well first let me say, it's been a while since I've done a let's play, so welcome back to that. Um, the controller work? Uh, yes. Cool. Um, so, I've been waiting for this game to come out for, like, a year or two, because it kept getting delayed, but it came out, like, uh, a week ago, I think. Um, I just picked it up today, and so I thought it'd be fun to let's play. So, basically, it's like a roguelike survival horror game. Um, so, Z just pick up weapons, but I'm using a controller, so I'm not really sure what the controls are on the controller. Uh, you just give me a second. So, circles to swing. Um, to loot is. I mean, X is to change weapons. Uh, square is to loot. Or the interact button, I'm guessing. I don't know what triangle does. Um, Jamal sees Maurice, who was a real dink. Zombies have broken into my home. This is probably your fault. It certainly isn't mine. When the group find, found this zombie bunker, Maurice called dibs on the spit. Well, actually, I'm gonna turn the game down. Sorry about that. I went to go turn the game down, and game DVR, uh, if you click off the screen of the game, it stops the recording. So I'm just gonna... But I listened to the recording so far, and I the game audio is fine with uh, my voice. It's just the game is gonna be loud for me. Okay, so, when the group found this zombie bunker, Maurice called dibs on this big bedroom before anyone else. Uh, we will convince him to help fight zombies. Jamal tries to lay on the charm and get Maurice to help fight the zombies swarming in. Maurice sweats visibly. I'm busy. I'm busy doing stuff. You go do it. Well, it's worth a try. This might have worked on someone that was less of a jerk. Jamal's wits revealed. Smiley face. Jamal's attitude revealed. Smiley face. Okay. Well, we'll leave you to that, I guess. So, I don't really, like, I've played part of the tutorial to test the game out, but, like, I haven't gotten any farther than the tutorial. Um, so I'm not really sure how the game works outside of the tutorial, but I guess we'll find out. Choose your pals wisely. Jamal greets a Abe. Um, I think we will have to leave the safe house. No, I'm sorry, I think we'll have to leave the safe house. At least we got the r to rest for a while. We should try heading to Canada. Would you like me to travel with you? More people means more hands to loot and fight with. It also means more people to get in the way, eat up the food, and argue. Yeah, we'll ask. We'll take Abe. The group accepts Abe to the team. Abe joins the team. Onward to Canada. We'll loot this. Um, so yeah, uh, where is the interrupt button? If you're playing with a PS4 controller, that is. Uh, circle is to swing. X is to change a weapon. I don't know if Triangle does anything. Or any other of the buttons. Okay, uh, what was that? Uh, R2 is start, like the, your menu. Um, cool. Okay, um, into the next room. Like, I'm already getting confused on the, on the controls. Can I bind these? They might bind these. If I can. Alright, oh, that's the play button. Um, can I switch my character? Oh, I can. Cool. Interesting. Cool. Um... I don't think I can, uh... Um, change my... Control, at least not in this game. Watch out for huge swarms. Running often beats fighting. Well, we're not gonna go in that room yet. Go on this way. Always be looting. This game, like I, like I played the, I, well, I started the tutorial like a couple times, um, because like I, the music just kept changing, and the music in this game is fantastic. Oh Jesus! I keep forgetting that the button is not square. I don't want to die in the tutorial. Pick a new leader. Oh, can't believe I died already. Uh, I'm gonna start the start that over. Actually, now that I think about it. Uh, yes, cause I wanna see if I can change the controls. 
Yes, I can. Um... There we go. Crap. Okay, hopefully that works. Um, so now we're playing as different characters, and right? now everything should work correctly. Um, okay. Cool. Uh, she has the same stuff. But I'm going to do this all again real quickly. Is, um, die. Uh, let me pick one of these other things. I guess this party member cannot join you at all. I figured that that's just a big kind of tutorial for that thing. My phone went off and fell down. I'm throwing that. Sorry about that. Okay. So, but like I said, I was waiting for like two years for this. I didn't back it on like Kickstarter or anything. But like, I kept tabs on it for the longest time. Can I give you a weapon? Can I drop my weapon? I guess not. Um, guess not. Oh, wait. Yeah, I can. I can give. Yes. Did you already have one? I, I keep forgetting what the plot, like I, I changed it to options, but I couldn't remember what it was. Okay. This is, well, that was weird. That was just right in front of the door. Okay, but like I always keep looting. Uh, down there's my food supply, my ammo count, my health. Uh, that's two separate ammo counts, like your handgun bullets and then your shotgun bullets. Your shotgun shells. You were not in this one before. Watch out for huge swans. Running off and beast fighting. That may be true, but I'm gonna kill you guys. Okay, so weapons break. Interesting. Good to know. Okay, so he's tired. Okay, you get tired. Good to know. Okay. Space for a team swap or info. You can... Okay. So zombies can travel from rooms, I guess, is the case, or they're just, yeah, I think they can. Let's go. Lead ladder leads to outside. Good luck out there. You found the ladder out of here. Climb out. Yes. Okay. What's the info? Oh, okay. Cool. Uh, we're just gonna start. Choose game option. Custom characters? Um... We'll make myself, because why not? No, that's pretty good. Um, wow, look at these dogs. Just front of a dog, give me a dog. And, oh, and they can level up, that's cool. Um... Is that what the random sports weapon game will play in fitness? Shotguns. Oh, start with a shotgun and 15 shells? How can I not? Trait. Uh, paranoid. Accomplish high perception, extreme pessimism, let's so race before May identify traits and new recruits always on the lookout for danger can be a real grumpus. <laughs> um. 
I'm a really current person all the time. So, but I don't really know what Permanent and significant morale panoply. Um. Sure, we'll go to the left. God, you can be pretty sure left person. Is there a no hair option? Or, yeah. I don't want to face. There we go. I think that's what I want. Oh, there's. 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 Okay. Um, yeah, hey, that's me. Um. No, I don't want to. I like those hats. I just the hat on the blue hat color. That works. Probably I can change the blood to be cool. Um, I think whatever that is works. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna save myself. So, I, mean, I don't know if that means I can play as them or what is good. That's that's weird. Um. Okay, we're gonna yeah yeah. Okay, I can cr okay, that's cool. Like, I can just play as myself every time if I want to. I won't do that. I'll just do that for the first one, and then I will uh, pick someone else. Uh, game mode, death mode, death road, normal mode, familiar characters mode. Most road recruits you meet are not familiar, char familiar characters that are random. They're characters that you've created and saved. Make your friends and family in that show up in the game. Um, rare characters mode. Special catch the unique abilities. Short trip to heck mode. A quick nine driving day mode. Another beating. Okay, okay. Long winded road. Deadlier road mode. Familiar extreme. Very extreme. The band all hope we to enter here. Kappa mode. Okay. Well, I think this is the only one I'm locked. Yeah, I'm sure we will be stuck on it right now. Okay. Um, Jordan hears rumors that Canada hears rumors that Canada is a safe place free of the threat of zombies. With nothing to gain from waiting around Florida, he decides to break the death road and travel north. You can switch for character you're controlling in the pause menu for final control. Let's read another hint. Dark dog barking, horns, gunshots, and other noise to zombies' attention. Okay, we'll just hit the road. I don't control this. The group spots the group spots an abandoned Yall Mart off in the distance. It looks like it's been looted. Maybe there's some untouched loot inside. Your zombie forecast is swarm size, mild, aggression, sluggish, current time, morning. Yeah, we'll go in there. Uh, so I start with a shotgun and a pipe. And Bryce starts with, it looks like an umbrella. And a pistol with 30 bullets. Cool, cool, cool. Let's... On there. That's Boogie. So is outside the mart or Okay, so sometimes you'll kill them in one shot and sometimes you won't. Okay, we're gonna ignore them for right now. Just... Oh yeah, you can trade for that. We're gonna try to move it around and save my weapon and just go inside. Okay. Pick up the food. Is that a sledgehammer? Yes, yes it is. I'm actually gonna save that and go back to my rebar. Uh, pick up the kit now? Okay. That's fine. Just kill the zombie regardless. I wanna pick you up. Is it X to pick you up? Don't fire your gun, Bryce. You have a weapon. A melee weapon. 
We're gonna attract them to us. What the fuck you doing? I mean, you may have saved me there, but still. What are you doing? What are you doing there, bro? Okay, that's health. Is that... Okay, I can! You're wasting your ammo, Bryce. Just punch them. You are hopeless. You're gonna get us killed. I mean, like, I appreciate it, what you're doing there, but still. Why did I go in the bathroom? There's never... What's in here? Gas? Okay. Oh, God. May... Okay, no. Oh, oh, okay. I was about to say, we may need to... Shotgun out of there, but no, we're good. I am tired. Need to calm down for a second. Killing these zombies way too fast. Okay, I think. Uh, let's go in here. Look at all the food. Get all of it. Get all of it. Or there's some, there's some stuff on here. Gas! Okay, let's leave. Don't shoot anymore. Let's go. There's one more room I missed. Oh, there's something over there. I saw something sparkling over there. Well, mind you, I'm just insane. Okay. Moving on. Hopefully nothing is in here to kill me. I see stuff sparkling. It's probably gasoline or something. And at this break, I still have my stuff. Gasoline. Every gas can counts, even if it's one. Like, I don't know how fast the gas runs out, but... I, I'm assuming it, it, it's like, runs out fast. But, regardless, we, we made it out, we made it in there, we made it out alive. There's nothing really around the car, let's get in and go! Oh, that's interesting. Oh, that's cool. You don't just get in and go. Like, you have to, like, start like start the ignition a couple times, and then you have to, like, push on the gas. That's cool. You could That could be, like, literally a second between life and death. That's cool. Okay. At the end of the day, the group hides in the drafty old house. Some zombies roam around outside, and the doors of the house are barely on their hinges. Should someone barricade the door? Um... Yes. Jordan barricades the flimsy house. He improvises. The results don't look pretty, but manage to keep the zombies out. The group eats a decent meal. L lose food. Is that like a... Like a... A typo on purpose? Seems like it. The group spots an infested city from the road. Scouting it from afar, the group has to decide whether to fight under the noon, noon sun for supplies. The forecast, zombie forecast is... Swarm size mild, or risen calm... Lost safe house or bar. Um, I'm gonna go for lost safe house. I think we're good. Let's be safe here. Don't tell me this is all for nothing. Please. Oh no, well I mean... Madison, let's go. Look at all this ammo. Do we share ammo? I, I don't think we do, but... Like if I pick up ammo, can I give it to him? That's a med, no, it's I don't want to leave my rebar there. But my rebar. My rebar. My rebar. But, yeah. what? Oh, look at all this stuff! Godlike. Yeah, I'm mean, gonna pick that up. Oh, there I can find a pistol. Well, not a pistol. Can I give him my ammo? Uh, 
I guess not. Or maybe if I swap. Yeah, yeah. No, no, he has a shotgun. But I'll give him my sludge. No, I'll take the sludge and take the pain. And I'll pick my rebar back up. It all works out. Even at the whisk piano. He also will have oh god. Did I stop him? Did you see him do the Ooh, a fire axe. Give me that. A hatchet, I'm sorry. There, okay. Is, the, is that my health meter? The, the flower? I mean, the leaf? Honestly, I have not really shot. I think I, I, think I got hit. But I, I want to see not too shot. Um, if I get hit again, I guess I'll look at it. And see. I'm not gonna, like, cascade and hit. That's, 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 that's kind of stupid. But, you know. Uh, there's another... Stop being tired. <sighs> Umbrella, yeah, that got you better. Can I Probably be played on most of this house. Um just walk like outside and see if there's any Oh, we're gonna go on this one. No, that's not my health meter. Is my health meter on here? Is it the heart like or something? Status? Okay, I'm not sure. I, I, I guess when I die, I, I'll just die. Yes. Did I go on this one already? No. Next. I'm not even gonna bother. What's the point? Got what I came in there for, and I'm gonna lose. Like I guess before, this music is really good. Can I work in the shots too? the other night. Um, in here. Okay, we're out of there. That's not too bad. Like he has the ammo though. Okay. I guess I can't get through here. Did he run out of ammo? Uh Oh no, there was a there was a bat in here. I'm taking it. Eight food, one gasoline, uh, five medical items, forty bullets, sorry, the crystal bullets, and then thirty-three shells. And we killed forty-nine zombies. Lost ten gas. Group runs into some people that are tempted to run a small farm. They offer eight food in exchange for some help. Um.
I don't know it. Oh, we help them. Um. Group helps with tilling the fields and prevent and planting new crops. It's exhausting work and they get very tired. Fitness review. Uh, fitness increase. Cool. Uh, Bryce. Cool, I got eight food. Oh, and I got a pitchfork. I can't wait to get out of this car and stretch my legs out. The group finds an end. Open for business. Go into rings his hands. Uh, give me a ton of food and I'll watch over you while you sleep. I'll reluctantly pay the ten food. The group pays to stay a night at the inn. It's unco it's comfortable. No one wants zombies creeping while they're sleeping. <laughs> Lose food. The innkeeper serves up an amazing breakfast. Okay, our morales went up. Cool. Ooh. I'm just glad we don't have to deal with bad zombies. Yeah, me too, Bryce. Me too. The group is blocked by another survivor group that set up a barricade to protect themselves. They're distrusting and heavily armed. The person they sent to talk is extremely annoying. Who should deal with them? Um, I guess I'll do it. Jordan talks to an annoying representative. He managed to be very polite after enough. Uh, no, sorry. He managed to be very polite after enough pointless questioning. The group slipped through the barricade. Cool, 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 cool. And more gas loss. Outside of Canada, most of society and civilization has been destroyed. You can still find people engaging in trade, with preserved food being the new currency. You have 18 food left. Share a visit food camp. Ooh. You a dog? You find the dog surrounded by a bunch of ammo. The dog speaks. Welcome to Ammo Emporium. Everything must go. It offers 5 bullets, 4 rifle ammo, and 3 shotgun shells per food item. You have 18 food left. Eh. This man is selling anime and anime accessories from a converted food truck. I am doing my part to keep civilization together, one anime sale at a time. You have 18 foods left. Buy no anime, wind star for 15 food, anime figurines for 10 food, or four katanas for 5 food. I'm gonna choose to buy no anime, despite me wanting to pick that so, so bad. Oh, what's me? The group discovers an unsettling and filthy van. It has a sign that says Easy Medi Medical College hanging crookedly on the back door. Inside is an uns unsettling and filthy dude in overalls. Well, who wants to learn about surgery? Uh, why did my brightness go down? Uh, I'm sorry, just give me a second. There we go. Uh, you have 18 food. Um, I kind of... Use my charm. Jordan gets free medical training. Hey, cool, cool. Sorry, Bryce. But, you know, I wasn't going to pay all that money for one of us to just get training. But one of us got training for free. <laughs> uh, Y'all are Jesus Christ. You can... Wow. Those zombies are straight. Well, obviously, because they were not there. Exactly turned out to be a nice day today. Yeah, that's true, man. You're right. What a nice day for a road trip. Yeah, that's true, Bryce. So this game is, like, random, so, like, I'm excited how other places this would be. The group finds a new person. Dorcas? She's alone and wants to join the team. She claims to be great at fixing cars and machinery. She says she used to be an engineer, but is evasive about what kind. Yeah, you can join us. Mm -hmm. group accepts Dorcas to the team. Dorcas joins the team. One word to Canada. He is covered with hordes of undead and wreckers that has been touched by a previous fire. The group gets surrounded, and their only chance is sprinting through the sores. The zombie forecast is swarm size, mild, aggression, hunting, current time, late night. And it's our only option. I have my pitchfork, though. Uh, you can take my pitchfork, I guess. Um... Yeah, you don't have a gun, so good luck. Yeah, good luck. Oh, there's a nice echo in here. Oh, God. Uh, there's only one way to go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Is this falling out of the sky? 
Oh, they're just coming, they're coming up. No, I didn't mean to do that. So, okay, as you guess if you can close the door behind you. Stop more zombies from getting in. Which is a cool feature. Um, okay. Another hatch. Um, so I'll pick that one. Well, it probably wasn't, but I don't know if it was like a freaking zone that we But like, it probably has more health than that one. I said that, and then on the next hit, it just snaps. It's gonna run. I think it's better to just run this person. Don't be a dead end. Uh, ladders! I'm gonna kill them all first before I lose it. Yeah. Ladders! You found the ladder out of here, climb out. 30 zombies destroyed. I was afraid it was gonna be like, oh, there's only two ladders. What if you couldn't make it out in time? That would have sucked. The group of feels inspired after managing to survive the situation. They feel like they are getting the hang of this. Choose a reward for the group. Um, that's cool. I can just choose like to be selfish and just do things for myself. Um, I think we'll do a morale and random skill game. Everyone, every day is a great teacher as long as you don't get eaten. Dorcas's moral went up, my fitness went up, Bryce's medical went up, and Dorcas's fitness went up. Cool. Very cool. This wouldn't have happened if we kept Obama out of the White House. Oh, that's hilarious. The group couldn't find any safe shelters, but was able to cobble together a campsite. The weather was terrible all night. Jordan didn't mind it much. Morale went down. Ah, oh, okay, there's still have good morale. Oh, we have a lot of food. There's still 12 left. That's not bad. We're gonna run out of gas soon. Uh. Oh. Okay. She is pushy. Anyway, the group finds another traveler by the roadside name Carolee. Not Carolyn, Carolee. She insists on joining the group immediately. The group isn't even given a choice. Carolee joins the party. Onward to Canada? Okay. Fantastic. Can I kick her out? We don't have food for you. The group is driving down the highway in a quiet countryside. Up ahead is a big crowd of burnt out cars with zombies roaming around them. Uh, we will investigate. I need stuff. You even have a weapon. Yeah, you do. I was kind of hoping you wouldn't, so you would kind of just die. Or whatever, but whatever. I hope there's something we can take from here. I said something sparkle. Oh, look at all this stuff. Oh, I'm siphoning gas. Interesting. I don't want to get gas from. I hope that's the only one. You guys fight, and I'll take care of everything else. You guys got this. Okay, there's more to the right. Cool. Um, right there. Oh, there's really nothing. In the okay, there's one. Or maybe the, maybe I can siphon from these cars. Okay, they just wouldn't come. Um, I didn't get a decent amount of gas though. Not like two, like uh, I don't know. I I don't know how to say it. Like not too like like there's a point when you're driving where it takes uh gas from you, and I have 20, so I have, I have two points for it, for gas. Okay. Um. Found ammo and stuff. That's cool. Are we there yet? Dorcas, shush. It's just another day on the death row when someone farts in the car. Drama and mystery consume the team. Pick someone to blame. Um. It was me. Oh. Oh. Oh, everyone's... Oh. I was blamed for it. I thought I was gonna... Okay. Um, Jordan is blamed for the fart. He shrugs in a good-natured way. The smell lingers. And everyone's morale goes down. <laughs> was this the real... The real carpet? Who can say? Wow. If you tie a string around your finger real tight, your finger will turn purple. Why would I need to know that, Jordan? Who cares? My morale went down because no one liked my joke. Well, it wasn't even a joke, but whatever. Uh, it gets late and there's no great place to camp. Solo zombies hobble around in the far distance and one might sneak up on the group while they sleep. 
So just stay up to watch. Take shifts, definitely. The group takes turns sleeping during the night. Dorcas is very tired in the morning, and other members didn't sleep great. Ow. We had good luck before, now our luck is really shit. What if I can get strong enough to just throw a car at zombies? We are low on... The group gets a rare, peaceful moment to relax on an apartment roof. There's time to talk, and someone reveals a lot about themselves. Uh... I don't know anything about Bryce... Or myself, I guess, but I'm gonna pretend that I know a lot about Bryce, and I'm gonna pick. Actually, I'm gonna pick Bryce because I'm assuming I'm gonna be His true essence. Wow, Bryce, all of your stats are garbage. At least I know now. The car's broken down from use and abuse. It won't start up again. Jordan attempts to fix it. Ooh, the crew spots a bakery van that has broken down on the side of the road. The van is irreparable, the bread is moldy. Uh oh. That was hoping that would lead us to another car. But at least we got some food. <laughs> oh god. The group gets sandwiched by zombie hordes while on a cliffside road. Without a car, the only way to escape was by jumping and hoping for the best. The fall is painful, but not fatal. And we're all hurt. Jesus. Walking along the outskirts of town, Carol Lee finds a small sporting goods store. It's picked clean of loot. Being all lost, Carol Lee spots an old SUV in the back of the store. SUVs have crappy gas mileage and are slow. They're also very durable, and they break down slowly. Just don't bother taking it off jumps. Interesting. That's pretty helpful. The group, been, the group is driving past uh, a whore before it turns ugly. When they see a gas station, someone is trapped inside. Uh, horde size massive, current time, near sunset, siege length, one hour, there's no escape. Okay, we are hurt, but... Wait, what? Oh. That's cool. Okay, um... Huh. Jordan says he was a famous video game streamer. That's so funny. <laughs> I mean, I'm not famous, but I stream video games. What are the odds of that? <laughs> uh, that's hilarious. Oh, Jesus Christ. Kind of bust out the shotgun. Can I blow up the propane thing? Guessing not. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, you can. I'm assuming that hurt us, though. Get this gas, though. Oh, I'm vibrating, taking my eyes off the screen. Get all this food. Thank you. No. I don't want to injure my fellow teammates. The siege is over. You can now try to escape. I want to rescue that person, then. Tiffany says that she really wants to get out of this place just so she can follow you around. Let her follow. She starts following Jordan. She could be useful if you can get her out of here, or a handy distraction if you can't. She with us? Yes, she is. Let's go! We did it! Help me, you assholes. Sledgehammer's not easy to swing. Cool. Killed most of them. Let's get all this gas. Okay, let's go, let's go. Yes. 
Success! Found 11 food, a whole bunch of gas, and 18 bullets. 84 zombies destroyed. Tiffany catches up with the group at a safe spot. She offers a reward and thanks for saving her. Uh, can I take more than the people with me? Aw, oh, damn it. I would have taken the group medical training. Um... That's a, that's a shame. Oh, cool. That's how healing works. Interesting. Well, that's cool. Christine, roll of toilet paper. Roll scavenging. Toilet paper was the first thing to run out after the apocalypse. Still a ton of canned food and ammo left in America. Decent butt paper was used to pass. Share this precious gift. Um... Ooh, the group decides to sell the roll of toilet paper as soon as possible. It's not worth carrying something that valuable around. A very interested party buys the TP for 30 food. Number more I went up. Smart decisions. Gotta be a leader. What we need is a lot of chainsaws. And we are out of medical supplies. The group sets up a camp outside a grocery store. They notice another group has been following them and will probably attempt to loot the place. Um... I'll go in. Hey! The other members stand guard outside for the looters uh, as Jordan searches the grocery store. Jordan brings, brings back food, and our, my morale went, goes up. Groove eats a decent meal. We ate most of that food that I brought back. But we have a lot of food, so it's okay. So we're all still, well, except for Bryce, we're all still pretty hurt. The group sees a bunch of destroyed cars on the dirt road in the distance, surrounded by zombies. It may be worth the risk to walk there and see if there's any loot left. Yeah, sure. Can I, like, save? Is there a save option? I, I, I don't think there is. I feel like if I press escape, it'll erase the save data. Like, abort the game and quit to... Oh. No. Maybe if I do it while... I'm not in a mission, like, while well, I'm on the road, it'll, uh, it'll save. I hope so. I'm not gonna hold my breath, I'm assuming this is like, I don't, I, I'm not, like, I'm gonna actually hold my breath because, like, I really do want to be able to save. But I want every episode of this to be just one run. But, you know, if it's not, then I think that's what it's me. Um, I think I picked up the other one. I picked up some stuff. Yes, that's good. Uh, we've got ammo. That's not, that's not terrible. Oh, okay, cool, cool. Um, so we're on the road, you can quit. You resume the game later with continue game. Okay, so, uh, I hope you all enjoyed the first part, and in the next part, um, we will continue on, uh, our adventure to Canada. I hope you all have a nice day, and until next time, love you guys. Peace. Good evening, my fellow citizens.